2017 has been a year to remember for Mark Leishman. The Australians climbed up to 16th in the world rankings thanks to a pair of victories on the PGA Tour. The second, a wire-to-wire -wire win at last month's BMW Championship as he held off a late charge from Justin Rose. Leishman may have led the whole way, but he knows all too well not to take anything for granted. That five shot lead was just enough to where you shouldn't lose, but not quite enough where it was out of reach. So, um, yeah, that was uh, not a great night's sleep I had there, but it's nice to play with some nerves sometimes. I don't get nervous very often, and that was very satisfying, uh, especially after what happened the week before and couldn't quite finish it off. Leishman had also held the 54 hole lead at the previous week's playoff event in Boston, but after shooting 30 on the front nine of his final round, he hit 40 coming home to slump to third. You know, you always tend to learn more from your failures than you do your victories. You know, I sat back that night and I thought, well, you know, what's, what can I take out of this, good and bad, and worked out the stuff that I could, uh, could learn. Um, my decision making was fine, just needed to execute better. You know, there was a lot of positives to take out of it, so took those positives, uh, learnt from the negatives. Mark's also had plenty to celebrate off the course this year. After watching his wife Audrey slowly recover from a rare illness that almost claimed her life back in 2015, the pair welcomed baby Eva this July, a little sister for their sons Harvey and Ollie. He was great, yeah, sleeping good, uh, very quiet. So uh, yeah, lucky, lucky to have a little healthy little girl. Audrey really wanted to have a little girl and we didn't even know if she was gonna be able to get pregnant. And we call her our, our miracle baby. Audrey was given just a 5% chance of survival when she was struck down with toxic shock syndrome before the 2015 Masters. Two years on and with a healthy family, Mark now has a different perspective on life and golf. You go from preparing for the biggest golf tournament in the world to not even golf not even being on your mind. It's really not about not life and death. Uh, it's, it's relaxed me a bit, I think. Um, Life's good at the moment. Um, you know, things are great off the golf course. You know, things are good on the golf course. Um, we're all healthy. It's, you know, life's in a good spot at the moment.